We've had breakfast. We're still in the OK Boutique Hotel, which is a lovely little hotel. It's very nice, really ornate, uh, wood carvings everywhere. It's really nice. Uh, we've uh, spoke to the Tuk Tuk driver already. Today we're going to do a bit of a tour around uh, Phnom Penh. Go to the Killing Fields, go to the old schoolhouse, and then uh, after that, we're not sure. We're going to see where the day takes us. and then on to the killing field. So we've made it to the schoolhouse. The Khmer Rouge developed an elaborate network of 196 prisons, referred to as security offices. Hundreds of thousands of people deemed enemies were sent for interrogation, torture, and execution. Security Office 21, or S21, was the largest and most lethal of this network. Located on the outskirts of Phnom Penh, S21 had once been a high school. Today from the outside, it looks no different from any other public institution. And ironically, S21 director Kangook Eve, better known as Dooch, was himself a former high school teacher. S21 was staffed by hundreds of guards, interrogators, documentation and office personnel. Prisoners were largely Khmer Rouge members and soldiers who along with their families were accused of betraying the revolution. Most were innocent of the serious offenses with which they had been charged. Images that you've seen are pretty horrific. Um, to think this happened like 40 years ago and less, but millions of people were murdered, killed. Absolutely disgusting. <laughs> Thank you. 
torture schoolhouse, or it is known as the... What's it called, Leanne? Genocide Museum. Yeah, the Genocide Museum, but it's got a proper name. But it's basically the... That's the uh, Genocide Museum done. Uh, quite some disturbing stuff happened during their reign. Uh, we're now off to the killing fields to see where they executed over three million people. Thank you.